Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode of what I called France Bush Trip. Last time we landed uh, on Castlet Airport not far away from Marseille and we've seen Marseille and also the stadium Olympique Marseille from the distance and we landed here. Now we'll continue with the next leg. This is the leg uh, 11, uh, not 11, sorry, 12. And we'll try to do this leg, leg 12, the next one 13 and maybe uh, another one 14. So uh, just af after we uh, take off from this airport, we will uh, have to go left and quite uh, back to follow our course. I already set up the heading of this uh, part, first part of this leg, and uh, without too much discussion and words, let's start flying. I disengage the parking brake and let's have a full throttle. That was not good. The trim of the, the plane was not leveled. But we managed to take off. And let's go left. I don't know what it is. But it looks nice. So let's read the first description from runway 13 at Castlet. Take off and turn north as you climb. Rise above above the mountain, the mountain range, just north of the, the airport. Okay, so I suppose we'll have to climb, to climb enough to pass over those mountains in front of us. I will engage the autopilot and the heading mode. We have a few clouds and uh, if we maintain this climbing rate we should be able to pass over those mountains in front of us. Look at the clouds, they are just beautiful. Let's see, so after we pass the, the mountains or the hills, we should 
quite maintain the same heading. to 360, 359 and then to 360. We just passed those mountains. We can see the shade of the plane on the ground. These mountains are like a wall. And we should find the town of Nan Le Pan. Probably this is the town. And beyond it, another shorter mountain range. I think these this, uh, mountains here. Make your way there. Okay, I'm doing it. And indeed, this is the town Nan, Nan Le Pan. I can see most of the houses ha have uh, pools. There are a lot of pools here. The people in here uh, are loving, are, lo are in love of having sun bathing around the pool. Okay, let's see what we have next. We are drift off a little bit on the right. So let's uh, let's go left a little bit. Maybe a little bit more. And after we pass these mountains, let's see what we have. Keep your northern heading and eventually you will come across the Verdon River flow, uh, flowing northeast and then the Vinon sur Verdon airport. So we should see another airport, but we are climb, still climbing, so let's stop the climbing because we are high enough maybe we will uh, we should be at a lower altitude than we are now let's let's do let's descend a little bit and i will adjust the course now to the new heading So to 360 to find this airport and let's descend a little bit maybe we should be at around uh, 3000 feet uh, let's do that Let's keep it like this. So virtual, okay. And let's descend. I reduce the power while we are descending.
We have an interesting shape here, but our view is blocked by the clouds. I don't know what it is. If someone knows what could what could be this shape, maybe you can leave a comment. So maybe you can have a look on Google Maps or something like that and maybe you can tell what this So in about four minutes, we should see another airport that will be Venon sur Verdon airport. I hope we will be able to see it. And we keep descending. I can't see any airport. But I can see probably a river here. Here. Maybe this is the river Verdon. I don't know, maybe. Yes, I can see the river here too. But I don't think this is the river we are looking for. And I still can't see the airport, maybe is after these clouds, or maybe here, I don't know. And I think, yes, I need to increase the power again because we uh, reach 
we reached the desired altitude and I think it's enough altitude in order to enjoy the landscapes I can see a lake here And in about one minute, we'll have to change the course. Let's read the description, continue north, and soon you'll reach the pro prominent town of Manosk. So we need to find another town. And I think this is the airport we're looking for. So it, it should be the Venon-sur-Verdon airport. It's just in front of us. And the Verdon River, it might be Probably this one. Okay, let's go back inside. So changing the course a little bit to zero zero eight. Uh, hello Aline, I don't know what fields you are talking about, maybe those shapes behind, we'll, uh, we'll uh, see what we have next, so now we are passing over the airport, we can see some planes And in about two minutes, let's see, let's close this one. We should find this uh, Manosk town. Some mining sites here. And Manosk maybe is here in front of us. Or maybe a little bit on our left. Another interesting shapes here, maybe some uh, warehouses. This is once again A51 highway. And the town of Manosk is right here. It's a little bit blurred by these clouds. I think here is another mining site. 
I wonder what they are mining here. Let's go back. So now we should go to zero twenty eight. Okay, and we should find in seven minutes. More or less, maybe we can increase the power a little bit, increase the speed. Running north beside Manosk, multiple rivers will lead you onward past several communes and villages, directly into a southern approach to your next destination, Chateau Arnou Saint Aubin Airport. Chateau Arnou Saint Aubin Airport. A lot of names for one single airport. So we are quite on course. So we see a lot of rivers in front of us, at least on the glass cockpit here. And somewhere here we should see our airport. Let's see how it looks. It's quite small, I suppose. I hope I will see it We have a lot of rivers here in this area And to build an infrastructure here, you need to build a lot of bridges. This is another uh, I don't know, town maybe? It is called Villeneuve. Lots of rivers. And we are actually following the highway A51. This could be sand, sand. We passed over the highway, now it's on our left. And we are on course. And uh, in about four minutes we should actually land. I hope I will be able to see the airport.
Let's have a look. Where is it? Maybe here in this area. Probably. So uh, if I look at the picture we have here on the right side of the airport, some river. Maybe this is the river, maybe. And here we have some towns, villages, I don't know. I can't see it yet. What time do we have? Two minutes and a, and a half. Maybe here. Oh no, here it is. This is the airport here. Let's see on which runway should we land. Um, maybe they don't say in the description, so I'll choose one of those runways. Maybe I'll take this one here. So let's disengage the autopilot. Let's reduce the speed, decrease the power and let's see how we will be able to land. Maybe it will be safer to, to have a look first on the airport. Or maybe we can land directly. Let's try to land on the runway in front of us. I'll try to land on this one here. I think we have too much speed for that, but let's see. At least we'll uh, have a look on the airport and we'll see. Yes, we have too much speed. If I put first notch of flaps, it's, they have one, two, three runways but we are too high for that and this is another one here maybe yeah let's go around Okay, let's take this one here.
and of course that was not what I sh what I supposed to do but let's see if we go back so we had once again too much speed and this runway was too short for this plane I wonder what kind of plane should land on this short runway here let's see if I stop here if the leg will be considered as checked no yes okay so we completed this one let's take the next one next next leg Saint Pong Saint Pong uh, maybe we will have a longer uh, runway for that okay so let's see after we take off we should go let's close this we should go right i will prepare the heading the heading knob okay like this and let's take off then we'll read the description of course we had the parking brake engaged we disengage it And I hope we have enough runway to take off. Mm, almost. Okay. We took off. Let's go right. And let's follow the heading. And uh, we are climbing. We should be able to cross over those mountains, but we are having a steep climbing, so it's not okay. So I will level up the alt altitude here to, to have more speed and then we will climb. So let's see the description. Take off from the airport and turn east as soon as possible. We did that. Watch for a cluster of parallel rivers running east from Saint Aubin, probably, including prominent waterway, the Blown. Follow the collective flow until another river joins from the north. Okay, here I think it will be the time to do to go to the next way, uh, waypoint. But let's climb a little bit more. We have enough speed now. Let's go to to maybe to this altitude here for now. And virtual speed go up not virtual vertical speed sorry I said virtual but it's vertical speed here and we are about to go on our left for the next waypoint so we found the river here let's close this one and turn left to 059 sorry 5859 okay uh, Dean Leban 
continue eastward with a blown even as it bends northeast toward the town of Ding Le Bang. Okay, so we are following some river be below us. I suppose this is the river here. And this is the river until we'll find the town. Uh, this is the town probably. Ding Le Bang. And then what should we do? Let's see. I suppose we'll have to pass over uh, these mountains. I don't see any other way, maybe some valleys. But anyway, we should climb more. So let's go back inside and see. Okay, we are reaching this altitude, but I want to, to go up more than that. So let's go to maybe 8,500, maybe it will be enough, I don't know. Let's see, and go up, go up. Uh, okay, it's not well represented in the game. We can see they have some stadium here. The river. And nothing else interesting to be seen. At least at, not at this point. An interchange here. I don't know what road is this. Anyway, let's see what we have to do next. Wow, what's this? This is not nice. I don't know what happens. Look at this. <laughs> what is this? Come on, game. Okay. Now, now is better. So yes, we have to go left, more left. Okay, like this. We still have mountains in front of us, so I think it's better to climb. Let's read the next description. Marku Confluence At Ding Le Ban, follow the river north a short distance before branching east at Confluence ahead. Heading east, you will soon arrive at yet another Confluence in the plains near Marku. So this is um, the river. Wow, once again we should go right. Now. To 037, yes, this is our course, and this is the river here, and I suppose we should find this confluence here. Now the river is white, or whitish. I don't know why, but it looks interesting. Hiking trails here. If you want to go On a hiking, 
and the white whitish river and this is the confluence here let's see what should we should do now uh, we are drifting i'll go right so next we have to go to 055 from the plane keep north then our northeast tracking with the blown the waterway will bend east near the small town of La Javie, just as another river joins it from the north. So less than one minute on that direction. So we should actually follow the river here. So let's go left a little bit. Okay, now what should we do? To 048. 048, okay, we are on 048, we are okay. Let's see next. Stay with the blown running east from La Javie as it arcs northward, follow the flow and climb to 9000 feet. I told you so may we are on the good track here so i will have only to increase for another 500 feet as you go watching for the river to bend eastward up ahead okay so let's see we're about to reach 8500 feet and we are following the river is blown is on our right here and the landscapes started to become more interesting interesting we have once again mountains okay 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 maybe we should climb faster And let's put to 9,000 feet. Okay. Let's see what's next. In less than one minute, we need to go to 060. When the river bends east, fly above the peaks directly before you. Heading northeast to reach a grand valley beyond. Okay, so uh, we have the desired altitude. 8,600, 700 and soon 9,000 feet and uh, we should have enough altitude to pass over the mountains in front of us what mountains are these Okay, ready to go right a little bit to 060 I said, yes maybe 061, we are drifting a little bit on left and we finally reached 9000 feet, so we are okay.
I did not look at the fuel. I think, I hope we have enough. Let's see what should we do next. Going left. To 0 0.46. This is close, but enough. Let's see the description. So we are here, zigzagging roads up the hill. Yes, we have. We s I, I see the roads here, zigzagging. Okay, northeast across the valley, you will come to find another river source, a mountain village, and zigzagging road. That will lead you into the heights. Okay, this is probably the village. We have a nice lake here, a small one, and zigzagging roads leading us up to the mountains, the heights. Yes, we are here up to the mountains, to the heights. What should we do next? Uh, we should go left, 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 not right, sorry. To 037. Confluence down the valley. Keep heading northeast into the neighboring valley and look for a river flowing from the north and then we should see the airport in about two minutes i don't know okay let's go left already already left left to three uh, five seven okay we should see the airport actually Let's see. Let's see the airport. Ah, there it is. They said to... Okay, truck with the river northern. Okay, I just like to northeast. The town descend for left pattern and arrive your destination. Okay, let's... We are... Let's disengage the autopilot and we should descend. We should have a steep descent. Um, maybe it will be not stiff and steep enough. Let's see if we have room to go around and to come from this direction or from this one. Let's let's go like this let's see if we stop the, the engine what happens Okay, the engine is stopped. Maybe I should start it again. I hope I should be able to do it. Maybe not, I don't know. Uh, 
I think I I did something stupid because I'm not able to start the engine again and I don't think we will be able to to land Let's see. We can land this. Why? Okay. I managed to start the engine. That's fine. And we landed. And I think this would be all for tonight streaming. Next one will be Notre Dame de la Salette. I think there is a landing challenge on this one. I'll let this for the next uh, the next streaming. Uh, in about uh, three or four legs, we will finish actually our journey in French bush trip. So uh, thank you very much for uh, flying with me tonight and see you on uh, the next live session goodbye